Hello and welcome to the Cogloss Analytics Coffee Shop Demos. My name is Will. In this series of videos, we're going to be analysing the performance of a fictitious chain of coffee shops by stepping into the shoes of key sales and marketing personnel. In this first short video, I'm going to introduce to you the Cogloss Analytics portal and show you how to navigate around Cogloss Analytics and get access to the right tools and help that you may require. When you first log into Cognos Analytics, you're presented with the Cognos Analytics welcome screen. Here, you can decide to display the default welcome with links to how-to videos, such as how to create a dashboard or create an exploration. We've got easy access to the samples with our wide range of industry-specific samples. And also, we've got a link to our accelerator catalogue for assets to enhance your CA experience, such as custom visualizations or sample data sets. In the bottom left, you have new, and here you will create new data modules, explorations, dashboards, reports, stories, etc., and also upload files. For those of you with administrator access, click on manage, and you have the tools to manage the platform, including setting up security, creating data server connections, and a whole host of other functions. The help section in the top right gives you quick access to our cognitive learning pane for recommended learning resources and also quick access to the Knowledge Centre. Your personal area next to this gives you access to configure your portal preferences such as language, time zone, and here you would access your schedules and your subscriptions. The navigator area on the far left is a key area and this is where you would access pre-authored Cognos content. Team content is a shared directory of content with reports, dashboards, data packages, all stored in a directory structure. All of this secured by permissions so that users can see as little or as much as they are allowed to based on their role. I can search for content very easily as well. And if I search for something such as sales and marketing, not only will I find items with these terms in its name, but I'll also find items with these search terms in its metadata or its content. All users have access to their My Content area where they can store private content. And for instance, if I selected this uploaded Excel file, you can see I have many different options to create content directly from this file. If I go above this to a report, I have options to run this into a multitude of different formats, schedule, and run in the background, send to email, etc. And finally, you can scroll between open content using the switcher at the top of the screen. And this is where you would close content as well. So that brings me to the end of this short demo. For further information on Cognos Analytics, go to ibm.com slash Cognos.